The uh, I watched the Blu-ray live. There's a whole making of. Yeah. Thing like that was on there. It's really good. I uh, like. I mean, it's a great feature. Uh, like, it's a great film altogether. And like, I just, I, I don't, I don't understand this. I don't understand the separation. And, and I, fair enough. I guess they want to sell stuff. I mean, when they did, they the, want to make it seem like it's value added. Yeah. Like when you're in the store, you're like, wow, I get two movies. And look at this. For like nineteen dollars, it's so amazing. And then you get home, and you're like, "Wow, it's sixteen minutes long." Yeah. And you're like, oh, well, all right. with with uh, with Kung Fu Panda, they did the Legends of the Furious Five, and so it was a it was a bonus thing with more of the like the you know the five ninja like just Kung Fu masters in there. I don't know how long that one is because I haven't seen it, but yeah, that Probably was also that sold long. since it takes them sold like separate two years yeah. to do this. Yeah. Probably took them like five months to do their sixteen minutes. Yeah, so yeah, this one is it's like half and half. It's half CG, half hand drawn, because uh, they like basically the guy's telling a story. Is when when he goes to flashback, they go to hand drawn, and then they go back to to the, to the CG. More packaging. Although you know what I've noticed these days is that these packages are coming out more and more. So they got the recycling thing here. The plastic is definitely flimsier nowadays. It feels so flimsy. And it's just different type of plastic. And even even like even now, generally when you see this these little arrow things, they're actually empty. So both, there's even more of it is hollow. Like yeah. so, basically, it's just the shell. Yeah. Uh, so it depends on the studio. Each studio does it does it differently. I think Sony is the one that does like sort of empty, half empty cases. All the Xbox games like that. I was just gonna say, yeah, video games are like that too. Yeah. And they feel it's funny. They feel like you pick up like a PlayStation Two one, mm -hmm. and then you touch the new Xbox ones. They're so flimsy. They feel like you feel like you crush it. Right? <laughs> yeah, and see, I guess that's just going to be the new normal eventually. Yeah. I mean, for now, it's, like, eh. it's interesting because the Blu-ray cases are not like that. No, the Blu-ray cases are good. High end, dude. You're like, I want to know. I'm getting the heavy packaging with the money I'm spending. <laughs> Blu-ray cases are sexy. There's something about them. They're small. They're good. Yeah, it is sexy, all right. Mm. <laughs> what, Jesus, what, what, what do you get? Uh, so yeah, this is uh, the Departed, uh, Goodfellas, and the Aviator. Um, but they're okay, and this isn't the only Martin Scorsese collection. I know there's another yeah. one that was like After Hours uh, yeah. and uh, After Taxi Hours Driver awesome. and Mean Streets. I think. Mm. Yeah, yeah. After Hours is great. I, I saw it. I'd never even heard of it. And I saw it on like the movie channel one morning. I was home sick or something, and I was unbelievably surprised this movie was on uncensored at nine in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> After Hours. I've never seen that one. Oh, it's hilarious. That's been going well, I think. Feeling a little like a little off kilter. It's fine. It's always fine. <laughs> whatever you get. Well, man, it. that's uh. It's always. It's always fine. whatever, you know. <laughs> I'm a little out of it. You no, can't be out of it. I'm out of it. You're Steve supposed to be my. You're my anchor. You're my Steve rock. Steve will talk. Don't worry. Steve won't shut up. How how can you run out of it? Uh, this guy. This guy. <laughs> yeah, blame it on, blame it on the guest. Blame it on the guy who brought all the wine. Wow. Oh. Did you know that he's a big wine drinker now? Ben Stoli. <laughs> <laughs> I, I knew he was just a big drinker. I didn't realize it mattered what was in the no, bottle. No, man. I I'm impressed, dude. And vodka is very healthy. It's vodka, it, hey, you know. vodka is healthy. White is right. <laughs> well, it's it's like less bad for you. If that, I don't know if that's that's synonymous. Less bad. Well, yeah, and like, well, we've been, I, I've been trying to work on my hangovers. So my hangovers are bad on beer. Uh, I don't know if it's whatever else is in there. So I'm moving on to wine. I'm the same way. I think it's the age thing. Yeah. Because we're in our like early thirties. <laughs> <laughs> and. Right. Whenever I, yeah. whenever I drink beer, I no matter how many I have, even if I have like a couple, I feel gross after. Yeah, man. You know, I don't know what it is. The wheat. Well, it's the thing. Like on short, short haul vacations, you know, you can go there and the first night you're like, I party with all your friends, and then like for like the rest of your vacation, you're just, uh, I can't do anything. Yeah, I'm the same way. You know, I'm trying to hold it together. Uh, See you guys. Yeah. Trying to hold it together. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just hanging on. I've seen you in a lot oh, worse shape yeah, yeah, on the show. So. Yes, you have. This is nothing. Here we go. Oh. <coughs>